It's taken us five and a half hours to get here, but gee, has it been worth it. Welcome to Cheetah Plains that sits in the Sabi Sands Reserve, some of the best game viewing on the planet, and this one of the most luxurious lodges on Earth. We're here with the Ranger Buck Safaris. It's myself, it's Maps Mapanyane, and it's Janil de Villiers, and we're in for a hell of a few days. I've been told by Archie from Ranger Buck Safaris that this place was pretty luxurious. The splendor, though, has blown me away. We're staying in the Mapojo House, one of three. It's named after a famous pride of lions from the area that are captured in a beautiful Conor McCready artwork. Art from Connor, Lionel Smith, and a range of other artists all over the place, including the gym, which looks more like a gallery than somewhere you'd work out. The food is terrific. They've got fantastic wine cellars replicated in all three houses. The service has been impeccable. The suites are vast. But best of all, that view out over the water, the resident pod of Hippo, and just this feeling that you're in one of the most amazing places on Earth. We normally see Max Mapanyan as the consummate young urban man, hip and cool, hanging out in the city. This is a slightly different environment. Is it one you enjoy, when you try and spend a bit of time in? Do you know what? I really, really enjoy coming out to the bush. I'm a huge lover of uh, nature. If I can get out of the city as often as I can, then I take that opportunity with both hands. And I think where we are right now is unique in the sense that there's a, a very modern touch to um, the entire experience. And meeting the bush while still having the incredible element of design and um, a, a wonderful attention to detail. Um, but also in a place where you can see it's all about conservation and really allowing the wild to be the wild, it's probably the best way to enjoy it. There are so many reasons to get out here, seeing the big five, uh, seeing some of the other animals, which are always fantastic. I love the giraffe. And there's also just that sense of reset. Now, you're probably the busiest human being I know. And this is a chance to get away from the world and to, to just get a clean slate, I suppose. Absolutely. Um, especially get a bit of a digital detox. And there's, believe it or not, for me, there's nothing better than going out somewhere where there's absolutely no signal and there's nothing you can do about it. So you're gonna to have to stay away from your phone, stay away from your devices and enjoy the present moment that you're in. For many people who come from an international destination into South Africa, into the bush, the safari is something they've either never done before or won't do very often in their lives. You do this every week, every month, and yet when we saw not just the leopard this morning, but pretty much all the animals, I saw your face light up. Uh, you don't get bored of this, do you? No, I never get bored. I can spend my life in the bush. Unfortunately, I do have to go back to the big city every now and again, but uh, if I had my way, I'd, uh, I'd base myself here. Yeah. So that if somebody's coming into South Africa, or in South Africa and looking for somewhere really special, they know that if Ranger Buck says this is the place to go, it's for good reason. Yes, that's the idea. That's the idea behind it, is that uh, I don't recommend any places that, uh, to my guests that I haven't personally been to. So I like to go there, make sure I know the area, which I've, I know this area very well. Um, and that's the whole idea of, of Ranger Buck, is that uh, when you come to us, we feel we can provide the guests with a, a tailor-made package to suit their needs, whether it's a family-friendly safari or a, a big five safari or honeymooners. Um, we've, we believe we've got the uh, experience and the expertise to recommend a suitable safari for, for you and your family or for you and your friends. And unfortunately, we are just about done with what has been a magnificent few days here at Cheetah Plains. Janelle, I don't think there's anything else we could ask for, really. Absolutely, you know, and uh, I think it's been a wonderful time here. And uh, there's one more thing that we, we haven't done yet. Um, and I think Maps is actually waiting for us on that. Looks like fun. One last surprise, one last day's of luxury. Let's go and take it on. Mm -hmm.